I was not lying when I said, this is my new drink. Look at it. Now I'm not an Ovis. I'm in Docking Bay 7 where you actually can buy this drink and all of that space magic on top. Oh, my cup runneth over. Cold brew drink. Cold brew drink. Got that space. Cold brew drink. Got that drink. Got that drink. Got that space. Cold brew drink. Don't care what people think. Got that space drink. Two minutes too late. Disneyland happens fast. Greetings, fellow citizens of Disneyland. Ricky here, today's adventure, whatever I feel like doing. One of my all-time top five favorite rides. The history, the prestige, the showmanship. I'd rather walk around Knott's Berry Farm than ride this. Sorry, family. What's the name of this train? Fred Gurley. Fred Gurley. Junk train. Junk train. Forward facing. I want stadium seating only. It, wasn't this corrected after? Nobody wants it. You gotta have standards. When Disneyland first opened, all the trains were this way, and people complained. Yes, and, and, and they, the boxcar style trains. <laughs> the boxcar is the best, and they treated people like cattle. <laughs> but they like changed it, right? And, but this one still runs this way. I think it's an original. Two, three are all stadium seating. Stadium seating is the only way I roll on the train. Gotta have standards, even at Disneyland. Good engine is called Fred Gurley, but the train is Excursion. Oh, Excursion 3! I am so sorry. No, it's okay. I heard a mask and I was like, and then you said Fred Gurley and I was like, That's the engine. Engine. Thank you. Oh, that's a difference. So Fred Gurley could, a different train, E.P. Ripley could drive the Excursion 3. So this is called Excursion 3 with the regular seating. Excursion 3, the blue one is Holiday Tag, the green one is Holiday Tag. Wow, thank you. It's fault. It's the Excursion 3. Sincere apology to Fred Gurley. That's just the steam engine that pulls Excursion 3. Excursion 3, dead to me. Now this, this is my style. Stadium seating, perfect. Perfect views into Walt's original Magic Kingdom. Definitely one of my favorite, favorite spots in all of Disneyland right here. And Galaxy's Edge only made it better. right now. This is fantastic. Look at this. They have them all lined up right now. 
How you doing? How are you? Good, how are you? Look Great. at this. Great to see you. Great to see you guys out. How awesome that is. This is one of the best things that's ever happened. I hope that these type of meet and greets stay for a long time. Because it's just fun just seeing that happen. Now I'll say hi to you. <laughs> What's up, man? What's going on, What's up, dude? It's been a minute, huh? Live in person. We're like internet friends, but in the non-creepy way. I don't know, maybe it's creepy. A little bit creepy. Because I'm a creep. Creepy. How you doing, bud? Doing good. Welcome doing good. to California. Dude, it's been way too long. First off, way you're short. <laughs> Second off. You're not that tall. Dude, come on. Welcome to California. Here. You did the last year in New York City. I not did. an easy thing to do. Thank God somebody sent you 40 chicken nuggets for Christmas. Oh God, that's sustained me until delicious. now. <laughs> did you have some too? <laughs> Dude, welcome you back, man. You think I can eat 40 chicken nuggets? Yes, uh, you, you know, can. You gotta watch out for the skinny guys at the buffet. You can. So what do you think? How's the first day back? It's awesome. Yeah? Uh, you know, it's, it's been since uh, November uh, 2019 since I've been here. Wow. That's a long and time. so the castle has a fresh new coat of paint. Does, did the castle fantastic. look small to you? Uh, the castle's always small to me just because uh, I prefer the Disney World <laughs> one better. Oh, it, <laughs> you can leave now. You, you can leave. Hey, how are you doing? Good to talk to you as well. So you live yeah. in New York as well, right? Oh, yeah, I'm his wife. You're his wife. Okay. <laughs> so <that's rude. laughs> What's it feel like to be back home? Great. Yeah? Yep. After that bizarre year in the city? Back to the Every, magic. There's no masks, no nothing. Yeah, you guys picked a great week. You yeah. couldn't have timed it better. Yeah. Yeah. Couldn't have timed it better. So good to finally meet you. What have you yeah, written? Likewise. Uh, so we did Rise of the Resistance. Yeah? First time? First time. <laughs> and? Oh my god. So You're we still did, high? Still high. Still, yeah. Yeah. So we were, Rise, just loved it, right? It was so good. Had it you seen so videos? Or were you a good no, boy? No. Like, That's I, hard. I, I, I was That's one, hard. I was one of the guys that <laughs> in the oh, beginning. Oh, easy, easy. Family bar. Easy. In the beginning, when you were twitching, and uh, I was like, no, 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 I cannot watch any oh, of your we're videos. Doing the, I cannot watch yeah, any yeah, of the videos. Yeah. Like, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm out. I'll be back in 20 minutes, though. Good play. Be Good play. I appreciate that. <laughs> I, I, I like that you came back. Yeah. No. Hopefully, you just let the video run in the background. Yeah, I did. I did. Yeah. <laughs> Dude. Magic, magic ever since. So, yeah. so good to meet you in real life. Man. So good. Good to see you. Nice to meet you, Ricky, folks. Nice to meet, meet you. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Bye. I'll see you later, bud. Bye-bye. Okay. So it's been a weird year, and it's also been a very special year because when the pandemic hit and there was no Disneyland, I put my creative talents to, to work and try to envision a way to reopen the park to keep the magic alive. And in a very positive way from something very negative, that little move brought so many amazing people into my life and has afforded me the ability to double down on Disney content to make it part of my career. And my man Andrew that I just met has been one of those people that has been riding shotgun with me on this wild adventure. And no doubt about it, in my mind, one of the people that I made it through the pandemic with. And that was the first time that we ever got to meet each other. And it kind of chokes me up because I've told so many people, hey, when this is all over with, can't wait to see you back on Main Street. And it's now happened a handful of times. And uh, every time it does, it's like a weird dream that came true or almost as if in a weird way, me and the universe were able to somehow plan this happenstance. Regardless, love meeting fellow citizens of Disneyland and even more so the citizens that helped me make it through this bizarre last year. Oh, are you seeing what I'm seeing? Are you seeing what I'm seeing? I have left Disneyland and I have entered Brickyland. I have it all to myself. There's nobody back here on one of my favorite spots of DCA. This is my first time being back here since the reopening. This has been closed and I got it all to myself. <laughs> Oh, I love it. I love it when I wander into one of my favorite spots and it's vacant solo. Ah, oh, what a great day. Yes. Saying hello to an old friend that I haven't been able to see in quite some time. I love standing in this spot so much on the back trail. <laughs> love the sound of people having fun after last year. 
It's even sweeter, sweeter than before. <laughs> I love it. This is one of those attractions. Never ridden it. Don't need to. I can get a contact buzz just watching it, just feeling the vibes. When you see me out there floating, you'll know I'll be doing my first ever stay at the Grand California. Because to me, ride, go to my room, change my clothes, back to the room in the park. I'm not walking around this soggy. Look at these people. They're drenched. I mean, look at that geyser. There's no need for that. Look at that geyser. Get ready to destroy those people. I had to come over to Avengers Campus just to see the level of characters. Ant-Man and the Wasp up there on the balcony. And then Loki is down there with this week's uniform on. They can keep this up. They can keep this up. This land will be a very impressive and awesome land. Fingers crossed they don't lose interest on the storytelling of Avengers Campus. I see where that is. Because you're so stingy. I can't stick up on you. That's great. <laughs> it makes you so excited. Like, you don't think it would make you that excited, but man, it does. It's so great. It's so awesome. I hope when you come here, you're able to catch a lot of characters, because it really, really does sweeten the experience.
Come back to ride with us again real soon. For those of you staying with us, we'll be on our way again in just a few minutes.